Hello everyone, welcome back to another video for me, Peace of my name. And today in this video, I want to give you the win from us on the Elite Frost Shine in our Season 2. We got the frame and I want to basically go through the weight, what did we did and what gave us basically the win over this, even when we have and then stronger enemy with her right now 45 players and 2.9 billion power and we still got it well as you saw i got marked there right um, my march got uh, a little bit cycle around it which was filling and it basically showing you that this march spawning one of these eye cycles which you saw what we trying to do or what we try to do basically in these weights is to place them in front of a main group right so that most of the people are directly safe behind the ice cycle right since at some point you're gonna do a big explosion which gonna cost you half of your march unfortunately in this uh, weight we lost two ice cycles already uh and actually one of that one got placed good um these three ones were placed okay not really good the, especially the last one there in the middle got uh, should have placed a little bit more forward because now you see all these archers there you know they're not doing any damage so you should always expect uh to place the ice cycles in a position where also your archers can still do damage behind from it so you see me now walking up because there you go is the a big explosion unfortunately because of the way how the ice cycle is working i was not fast enough to get uh, around the corner and i basically got hit and you see i lost half of my march um now you see we're going to the left side to trigger that some people getting bugged and that's also what you saw four people um got stuck on the left side directly uh while the rest got push back to the other side of the area well what we obviously doing here is wherever the uh, snowball is going uh, we going behind the ice circles to get safe other people trying to get forward to get behind the uh, blue line to not getting killed or not to get uh, getting targeted by the snowball right um yeah and when you see we just uh, doing this phase, people dodging the, the snowboard to not getting killed. I think we lost here probably three more people. I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, not on this one. This yeah, pancake dying because of explosion. Uh, yeah, that yeah, f uh, four people we lost overall in the weight. And now we basically having the phase where you have around two minutes uh no two and a half three minutes around that time you have for doing dps before the next phase starting so we basically need to kill now in like around three uh, two minutes one million hp from the giant and as you see we have quite a good amount of dps and yeah that's what we continue doing, dodging the, the snowball there, or most of the people doing it to not getting damage because as we know, every time you're losing troops means also less damage, right? So we continue here, dodging everything, placing the, uh, the eyes in a way that we getting safe behind it because the, the tech technique here now is after this first phase is that he's doing the big explosion, right? And then the trick is that he's gonna do another two times of an ice cycle. So you have six ice cycles basically for the second phase, right? As the difference is between the first and second phase, that in the second phase where you where he's throwing the snowballs at you, that he is not spawning ice cycles. It's only in the first phase of him doing the snowball throwing at you. I don't know what I did there, but my march was going forward, but I was uh, luckily fast enough to get in time behind the ice cycles, so I, don't, I didn't get killed. Um, yeah, and now you see 
we have basically the second explosion f phase done. What he's doing now gonna be another two Isaac spawning. And it, at this point, we already knew, all right, we're having enough time to kill him this time. Because the, the, the wait right before this one, we got it down to 90k before six minutes for, uh, before the second phase started uh, at around six minutes. And when he's basically starting this second phase before you have killed him, you don't have enough time to kill him, unfortunately. But as you see there, we're having him at 100k now before the snowball. We're standing there just to continue DPS. At this time, uh, at this point, we would lose more DPS when we get, uh, when we do, uh, when we're getting hit by the snowball. And there you go. There we got it, guys. Ah oh, man, that was that was really nice. So that are two out of two frames right now for HH. I'm very happy about this, especially because I didn't uh, got this one unfortunately on my main account. So I'm even more happy that I got this giant frame on my second account at least. So yeah, and where you see us celebrating in the world chat, in the line chat. And it was amazing. It was literally amazing. So as you see guys, if you have a little bit of coordination and people following cards, it's pretty easy to kill the giant, uh, even as a new one in season two. So yeah, I hope this video have entertained you and also for anyone else who's watching this, gonna help you how to kill basically the giant. And yeah, with that said guys, thanks everyone for watching. Stay healthy. And we're gonna see us soon on the next one.